Right, we're about to head out. It's a quite a nice looking day at the moment. And we're gonna go around and check some of the pots. We did a few yesterday, but we haven't done them all. So that'll be our plan today. We're gonna to do some of those. Um, we might do some fishing somewhere along the line. That is undecided at the moment. And we will work that out as we go, but we definitely wanna get some pots done. A little bit of sketchy weather coming, so get them baited so they can ride out the weather with baited. Otherwise they'll sit there doing nothing. Doing nothing. Doing right. nothing. But it is but that... We will, we will be for the next 10 days. But it is that time of year where a lot of lobsters change their shells now. So you won't see a lot because they'll be changing shells. Anything that's changed its shell isn't any good anyway. Yeah. Right, let's get going. We've just seen this pot here, but it's got a load of weed on it, it's barely floating, it's low tide, so probably abandoned I would have thought, but we dropped this one yesterday, but I never saw this, in fact I never saw this when we pulled the pot here yesterday, but you can see all the weed on the rope, it's very heavy, it's almost sinking that pot, make sure it's not one of ours. <laughs> One lobster. Yeah, look at that. It's been chopped off. Yeah, it's been in a fight with another one. Yeah. Lost its claw. And uh, that piece snapped off. Um, hold on to that one for now. Need to go to the side. The bait is.
definitely size that yeah. one. Another one. There you go, two nice lobsters. Well oversized those two. And another two. Another two. Undersized. That one looks size. Well, we'll try them. <laughs> Just under, mill under, only just under, but it's under. Um, that bait, you want to just slip that onto it as well? We are out and we started bassing. We haven't done anything yet. We've trailed up and down a few times, but nothing at the moment. We did stop for a cast, but Rebecca's just hooked something, but we think it's probably seaweed, but I'm going to film it anyway because it's all you're going to get today. Desperate times. Desperate times. Yes, lovely bit of seaweed. But um, now we're going to keep going and uh, I'm going to um, going to uh, stop after this and we'll do some casting. But... You're flipping far back, were you? You were, you were back in Herm again, weren't you? Yeah. That's another island several miles away. But... That sounded fishy. That is a fish. That's a little baby bass, look. Only a little one, but it's a bass. There you go. Superb, that's going to fall off any minute. Um, I'm going to do it over the side because it comes off. Just going to get the pliers. Get the pliers. And either way. There you go. First bass of the morning. But only a little babby one. They're quite good, the prison ones. They're not great at moments. Like, there's some days they don't seem to work very well. Other days they do really well. Today, doing really well. Well, it, it's caught two fish. Well, it's not. Yeah, let's just see what this is first. Before we get too excited. Right, Rebecca's get, not getting too excited. <laughs> She's hooked another <laughs> fish. Don't make me laugh, it puts me off my rhythm. And it puts her off her rhythm, the fishing as well, and laughing. I just keep the boat ticking along just to keep, because we've got two lines actually, one there, and if I stop then it slackens up and then the lines can cross. Also keeps the bass or the pollock or whatever it is pulling straight. They just go very, very slowly, it's enough to be able to reel. Also makes the fish feel bigger. <laughs> Right, and I'll knock it out of gear when it gets closer. How many miles back you said today then? Yeah, not. You're almost here. Yeah, it's crossing over there. Yeah, so right, I'm gonna I'm gonna turn the boat. Just, just keep going, keep going, keep going. We'll spin the boat around a little bit. Like that. Okay. Yep, it's another little one. Yep, another baby one. Wires. There we go. Getting a little bit bigger. Yeah. Oh, lost the hook. There we go. It's gone down again. That's that uh, no, seaweed. So I've either hooked seaweed or a small pollock. Actually, I'm going to say pollock. It's on the surface and they drag up like that quite often. No, actually it's seaweed. It is seaweed. It's seaweed. There's my fish. It's a very nice brown one. Oh, I reckon at least seventeen pound maybe. I can barely hold it up. About seventeen pound that one. Look, look I'll put it close to the camera. Give you, give you full view of it. Yeah, about you know, sporting all that. Gonna let it go. There you go. Look at it, gut. See, there's not. Oh, hang on, you didn't give up there. Oh. Right. Look, look at him go. Look. See him flapping his fins. Yeah. That will be all right. Yeah. Right. Don't put it
Well, it's just box, box. We put macros the other day. Lobsters, nice big one. That one, I don't know. Can get the gauge on it. It's in. Yep, legal. Two legal lobsters. There you go. Nice. Glad we came and did these because yeah. we were we're debating whether to bother or not. But being the weather was going to get a bit funny, we thought we'd better come and have a look. And sure enough, two nice lobsters. Excellent. will be says me been towing around for uh, quite a long time and we've been mackerel in all sorts and we're just not really catching but now I've hooked into something and I think it's fairly decent you want to get the net as well straight away yeah I'm not gonna mess around without the net on this one just that nets that's it it's not that big but it felt much heavier than that I tell you or did something grab hold of it Maybe that's what I felt. Maybe a seal then. Oh. Something that old of it. Yeah. I say it felt really heavy when I hooked it, but that's not even a that's not even a legal sized bass, that isn't. But it's got teeth marks in it. There we go, is it? Possible that yeah, look, it's bleeding. So it's a. Yeah. I reckon that's what it is with the seals. Chomped into it. Yeah, if you lift it up. And there it is. Little bass. And like I say, it felt so heavy when I hooked it. I thought, what the heck? And uh, then it's obviously come in and it's got a great big hole in the side. Maybe a seal that latched onto it when I had it. But I said to you, this is massive, eh? Yeah, well you did. You thought it was a rock. Anyway, because we've just seen some seals, so possibly it is. I'm just out, out of interest. I mean, he's only going to be about. Before we let him go. Yeah, he's about 40 actually. Mm. About a 40 centimetre. There he goes. He's gone. Salt will soon sort that wound out. Yeah. 